the very first time that I heard them play it, um, I remember I had goosebumps all over my body. Um, I was only 15. I remember um, I had signed a contract with Alpha Records at the time. Uh, kaka graduate ko lang from the TV show. I, I hope you guys probably remember the TV show That's Entertainment. Um, and um, I remember I, I didn't really know uh, who uh, Veni Saturno was at that time. Um, basta sabi lang sa akin ng mga taka Alpha Records that he is definitely a hit maker. And that, you know, for my first single, they really um, asked him for the song. And it was Jerry Paradiso that, um, that did the arrangement. And they were very confident that we, that it was definitely going to be a big hit. And they were not wrong. Mr. Cupido is a song that will always be very memorable sa akin um, kasi ito na nga yung very first single ko and I remember very well um, nung first time kong narinig siya on the radio um, being played on the radio the very first time that I heard them play it um, I remember I had goosebumps all over my body I was sitting on the terrace with my family eating merienda <laughs> As I remember, and then suddenly we heard um, Mr. Kubido being played on the radio, and we were all jumping up and down. So um, here it goes, okay? Mr. Kubido, ako na may tulungan mo, but hindi pa nain ang kanyang damdamin nang ako ay mapansin. Um, si Benny pa yung kumakanta. <laughs> I remember lalaki yung bosses and I wasn't really, I didn't even know that that was uh, Benny. Pero uh, when I heard it, um, iba pa yung phrasing eh. Naalala ko, um, iba yung phrasing na ginamit nung sa demo and eventually of course nilagyan ko na ng sarili kong flavor. I wasn't really, uh, I, to be honest, um, siguro because I was 15, I was so young, I, I didn't have idea kung magiging hit ba to. I mean, I didn't have the ear. I didn't have a trained ear for what was catchy, what was not catchy. Um, basta I knew medyo uso that time yung mga tinatawag nila na medyo novelty. Yung bang merong parang hinahalo na mga English words here and there um, to make a song kind of more poppy and more youthful. So, um, nauso na mga time na yun yung mga, mis of course, Mr. Pupido, Mr. Dream Boy, yung mga ganon. So, um, yeah, I mean, I thought, you know, that it had a good, um, definitely had a very, very good melody and it was, it was a lot of fun to sing. Um, I remember I was so nervous, so hindi ko masyado napansin, um, how then he was exactly, but definitely, um, he and our producer, the, re the, the one that was producing the album at that time, they were, they were ano naman, they were they were kind. <laughs> Cause I was a beginner, so I mean there was a lot of guidance, um, definitely. Um, I you know I think they, they made me feel very at home. Happy 40th anniversary um, in, in the music industry. Uh, Benny is definitely one of the pillars of original Filipino music and this is definitely a huge milestone for uh, for Benny. I wish that we had collaborated more. Um, I feel like we could have done many, many more songs together um, if given the chance. And in fact, when I saw the musical uh, Chuva Choo Choo <laughs> with, um, with Joanna and Peel as the, the, the lead, um, I, I was just amazed. I think there might have been like 30 songs that I could sing along to in that I think it was like a three-hour musical. It seemed like three-hour musical, but it, the music was just wow. I mean, it it was really something. What an achievement! Man. I mean, you're you're really one of the gems of uh, of the Philippine uh, music industry. Mabuhay ka! Congratulations on your 40th year.